Hello everybody, I'm Chris Olds, this is Derek Fickett, and we're here with a different edition of Box Busters today, and then it's me doing football. Me here. And you here, you're not, the, not a norm, but uh, 2014 Press Pass football, hot in from Press Pass shortly, recently. And uh, what do we know? I don't know. Six autographs per box. It's obviously 2014 draft class. Uh, Johnny Manziel is the big name in here. You got Teddy Bridgewater. Blake Bortles. I mean, you got you got a bunch of cool stuff on card autographs. Ooh, I see AJ McCarron. It, I mean, yeah, the list goes on and on. Derek Carr, AJ McCarron. Sixty-five top players signing for this product. So this is a meaty box. It feels rather rather thick. Thirty packs. Yeah. So I think we should just start shredding. The uh, obviously Press Pass does not have a CLC license, so we're gonna have some uh, photographic restraints, making making it probably more all about the autographs. Which is not a bad thing. And so, jeez. Uh, Struggling with it. I know, trying to, just yeah. trying to get a box open is a challenge for me these days. A Friday, 4 o'clock. Worn out. It, Look it, out. It, it took it out of me, no pun intended. <laughs> oh, wait. Da da dum. <laughs> this is right. what you get when you put me, me in a football video. <laughs> ready? I'm ready. Let's I'm already it. ready already. It's going to be a lot of uh, names shown here because I yes. really don't know anything more than four or five names. And, and I'm, I'm struggling, watch. Oh my goodness, there it is. We're keeping that one. That's a pristine wrapper. Yeah. Oh, actually, there's a wrapper redemption for this brand, isn't there? I wonder if they'll take two. Take that, yeah. I was gonna save the wrappers in case there was. Well, I got my first autograph, number to 199, Ryan Shazer. Shazer? Right. Oh yeah. That's... Ohio State. Uh, hey, look at this, first pack, gold parallel, of a guy that I've gone on the record saying, yeah, well, I'm not a fan. Johnny Manziel. <laughs> but there are lots of other fans. This is a very minimalist design, but I actually like it. It's very clean. Press Pass does a good job with the simple, clean, elegant presentations, and this is actually pretty nice. There's a, there's a little bit of a honeycomb background on the, behind the white, behind the player. If you could zoom in a little bit more on that, you might pick it up on the camera there. So that's cool. It's a nice looking touch. Yeah, I dig the uh, on the base cards how the player is zoomed in almost, so it pretty much takes up yeah, it's, the whole card. Yeah, it's a card. requirement actually. With with, uh, with their licensing deal, they have to they have to remove logos and and there are I, I don't know the peculiarities of it, like mm -hmm. the very specific stuff, but there are other trade things they have to not show, yeah. like eliminate trim and such. Gotcha. So it's part of it. I, I think it's also their choice. I think they've done that the last few years. Okay. It's less work to yeah. have to remove the entire uniform's, you know, touches. Let's see, my second pack. Ah, oh, yes, another top name that I should know. Who you got? J. Devon Clowney. I can't say his Davion name. Davion Clowney. There you go. There it is. Am I spell it. I can't actually. That one I don't have to spell either. I have one of the greatest nicknames of all time. Ha ha, Clinton Dix. Roll Tide. Roll Tide. <clears throat> I'm on my. Oh. Back to back, Zach's. Boom, boom. I'm on my fourth pack already. No hit yet. I wonder if there'll be a no hitter. We've never had that in a box buster's history. That'd be nuts. Yeah. I would be honored. Really? It, no. I mean. <laughs> it's kind of a dubious distinction. The Harvey Haddocks of box yes. busters. Went the distance and got nothing. <laughs> I'm up to another pack with no hits. Uh oh. Teddy Bridgewater, though. There you go. Maybe number one overall pick, you never Marquise know. Oh, I got Lee. Teddy Bridgewater too. Wow, they don't even display the team's name anywhere on the cards. It's only in the uh, blurb of the editorial blurb, I guess you want to call it. Well, there were, I think on Different. the autographs. They probably have some other info. Yeah, if I can find it. Yeah, the autographs, they have Ohio State in his they position. Oh, that's yeah, good. so that's kind of cool. It, I mean, it's something like for me, I am sort of pseudo-retired. I kind of, I dabble here and there a box or two a year at most for football mm -hmm. these days. Yeah. So like, I know names, I know from highlight reels, but I just don't have time to watch college football anymore. And, uh, except for maybe a bowl game that this guy was winning, A.J. McCarron, although I did watch in a losing bowl game that he was in. Anyway, uh, wow. And not to get off tangent, but check out that face mask. <laughs> so, so it's one of those things for me, you know, I, I'm a very, I'm probably honestly closer to a beginner for collecting football at this point because I'm so out of the game per yeah. se. So 
having that team name on there, which was the point I was trying to make, is probably a positive for beginners or for people like me who are just more casual with the ripping of, of football cards these days. Yeah, I mean, with, with this sort of draft class, they're kind of higher, higher names. Yeah, a little and bit stronger than last year. Yeah, a lot of people know without looking at the team colors or, or you know, logos, you can figure it out. Here's a reflectors <laughs> parallel. Oh, 199 yeah. Brandon Coleman. I have no hits, no no reflectors yet either. That's not good. I know. Well, that's gonna be end loaded. I'm gonna get so much good stuff at the end. Yeah. It's ridiculous. You just process. And another pack. Through. Nothing. I did get an Odell Beckham Jr. though. No relation to Tim. Or or David. David Beckham. Oh yes. It's football, right? That's yeah. Football, football humor. Football. Another pack. Nothing. <laughs> Blake Bortles, I'll show that though because he's a top name. And CJ Mosley, actually. Oh, got my second Little autograph, time. Marquise Lee of Southern California. That's a big, bold autograph. That's one thing that's cool about these. Not not using stickers, yeah. which they rarely do, but uh, it, it allows for the players to get you know crazy with their autographing. Yep. And this is one of the earlier products, so they're going to be more apt to take time to do that. Exactly. Later in the year when they've signed 9 million signatures, they're, they're just going to check yeah. mark it off. You know? Exactly. Okay, this better be an autograph pack. It's a reflector pack with a Teddy Bridgewater base card and a Justin Gilbert reflector out of 199. Not There's too that. shabby. There's that. I like this one. It's got a little more action to it, a little coiled up quarterback pose. I'm going to get the most ungodly run of, of <laughs> hits here pretty soon because it's just evening out. Yeah. It's got to. Khalil Mack, pretty sweet. Return of the Mack. Return of the Mack. Or Khalil yeah. Green. That's all I got on that one. That's all you got? Okay. First autograph, finally. Whew, I felt like Aaron Rodgers there, waiting and waiting and waiting. <laughs> Brandon Cooks from Oregon State. Brandon Cooks with Brandon with an I. Yeah, Tyler Gaffney, David Fails, Marquise Lee, Taj Boyd. And we got CJ Mosley autograph, 199. He's related to that wild boxer, right? Uh, Sugar Dustin, Shane Mosley? Sugar Shane, yeah, that's it. Maybe. I'm just trying to put him on the spot because I got nothing. <laughs> I'll, 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 that'll be the added value of me being in this video. Another hit list one, but that's okay. They can't all be hits. But they're supposed to be six in a box? Yeah. Six out of 30. I'm going to get like five in a row here pretty soon. <laughs> yeah. Timmy Jernigan, Eric Eberin, Trey Mason, Paul Richardson, and Lash Lash Seastrunk. It's like a hockey video, right? I'm butchering all the names. Here's Trey Mason, Auburn. That's why I knew I didn't like that name. No, I went to Alabama. Really? I finished in Alabama. So. Okay. Yeah, I'm not from there. So I don't claim them as much as the diehard crazy people do. Because yeah. there are plenty of them. Oh, yeah. But uh, I watch them from time to time, time to time. I almost went there. I was uh, I was there, finished up uh, my first year. My first game was Sean Alexander's finest game. Wow. For 291 yards against BYU and set the school record. Nice. Meaningless trivia about all this. Leish Seastrunk? Probably See, said yeah, that wrong. No, I said it wrong just a minute ago. <laughs> all right, this is Baylor right yeah. back. Check this out. Two packs in a row. CJ, CJ, CJ. Whoa. Two packs, three CJ. CJs, and are, they're all Alabama. And I still like this guy's face mask. That's epic. <laughs> it's, it's like, like he's Predator. a gladiator or something. Yeah, yeah. gladiator. All right, next pack. Got no autograph. Blake Nothing. Bartles, Trey, Trey Mason, Timmy Jernigan. <laughs> I've gotten this pack before. Yeah. Man. Derek Carr, the brother of NFL bust, David, David Carr. Carr. Wasn't he in a band in the 80s? Who? David Carr? Yeah, Derek Carr. The Cars? Uh, well, yeah. Or was, that, that, that was, or was that that Irish band, the Cores? Cores? Oh, wait. I, don't know. I should look that they up. They sang with Bono. Uh. MTV Unplugged. Come on, somebody, work uh, with me. I think I was like three or something. No, it's not that old. But yeah, no, I'm, I'm just messing with you. It's not even about you. I just got nothing to say because I, I, I just got my second hit. Oh, there you go. What do we you got? Know? Now I can say something. It's actually a, a blue parallel. It's the football background. I don't know what yep. the, the, the scheme is this year, but out, numbered out of 50, a uh, Jeff Matthews autograph. He went to Cornell. Cornell quarterback. 
Yeah, there's something cool about the autographs. They have different ones. Yeah, they've done it for a while. That one's just a football. There's this one. You have the jersey number. Yep. Um, this one, you have X's and O's. Yeah. So they kind of have different. And there's red, rarer autographs. Yeah, there's typically the real chase. jersey number in the back. So, I mean, it's pretty cool. It is. It's, it's a simple touch they've done for a long time, actually. Back when I wasn't retired from some football collecting, they, yeah. they did a lot of this. I have an X's and O's autograph of Robert Herron, numbered out of 199. Right. Wyoming wide receiver. So, the state I grew up in, Wyoming, there you go. This is a box that was tailor made for me, so there's an AJ McCarron autograph coming next. <laughs> Thanks, Press Pass. Too bad I don't get to keep any of them. That's a, oh, here we go. Here's the reflectors parallel to 99 go. with the nasty face mask. Stephen Truitt. I knew this was a Florida Gator. But I had to look just to tell. Marcus Robertson. Timmy Jernigan again. Oh, yes. Ha Sean. Ha Ha Clinton Dix. Yep. I actually didn't know his first name. I didn't either. That's a good touch. I don't know. We'll see how that comes when, in terms of the NFLPA licensed products, whether they go with the nickname or not. That's the first time I think I've seen them. Anywhere? Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that'll be interesting. <laughs> I should have had a joke for that. <laughs> Subtle, right? Yeah. Lewis Nix, the third, number to 199 autograph, X's and O's. I got an AJ McCarron, but not autograph, so I called that part of the shot. I still have three autographs to go with about 10 packs. I think I'm done. See? Uh, I'll probably be extras, just wait. Sweet. I like extra stuff. It'll happen. Blake Bortles, Gold Parallel, a Jarvis Landry. Gold reflector out of 99. So there must there must be two different kinds of reflectors. So presuming gold, gold foil. Yeah. Sounds about right. I literally couldn't tell you anything on this stuff. Johnny Manziel, I know he's a quarterback. He beat Alabama, I think. <laughs> no, I don't. Did they? No, I, I don't even know if Alabama won that game. I don't remember. Alabama won this year. Did they? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah this year. That's they lost the last. Year. It looked like they were going to win, or he was going to win this year, but it didn't happen. Yep. Yeah. Mm. Eric Ebron, Derek Carr, or Jean Neal, Darquez Denard, and Jordan Matthews. Once from Alabama, once from Georgia, once from North Carolina, once from Georgia. Georgia wins that pack. Hmm. That's a lot of packs. I think that's, we probably could have just done one, but that would have been as much fun. No. But, uh, you know, this is a brand that it's not a huge base set, so you're going to get a lot of dupes. We've yeah, had several. I've had a lot of dupes. You may end up even with a close to a parallel set because there's 30 packs. I presume it's 100 cards at the most. Yeah. Maybe even less than that. I think it's maybe 50 or 75. So, yeah, you could come up with almost a parallel set. Yeah. At least probably half a parallel set out of a single box. Khalil Mack, Marion Grace, Charles Sims, Jared Abbeveris <laughs> from... I don't even know. Big Ten, so Wisconsin. Jarvis Landry. SAC, autograph. Oh, Red Ink. Red Ink, yeah, sir. Red, red ink. ink. Boom. Might be short printed, just not numbered. I, I have an autograph. Finally. James Franklin. This guy, this guy's autograph is tailor made for stickers. Oh, jeez. Numbered out of 199, but it isn't actually a signature. It just says J. Franklin, but it's a tiny autograph. Yeah. Missouri quarterback, James Franklin. He's from the Yogi Berra School of Signing Size. He believes in leaving plenty of room for his teammates on his card. <laughs> Somebody didn't get that, but I'll fill it in. The person <laughs> over here was like, what are you talking about? He's just, he's just out of it. It's Friday. Probably, play, probably playing games on his phone. Probably. Just not paying attention. All right, I, got, I have five packs left with two autographs to go. I am all out, so I'm going to see how many autographs I got total. They're the ones with the black border, sir. Well, I'm also getting the reflectors out because <laughs> I will be working with this product. You will be. You get to sort all this stuff. Can't wait. I don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> yep, six autographs. So what do you think? I mean, it's a simplified look. It's 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 actually a look that for huh? base cards might be a little taxing, but the player selection is pretty solid. Honestly, I like it. Yeah. You know, I'm, you know, I've. 
on Beckett Radio, I've talked about how I like, as far as licensing goes, I like logos. I like to look yeah, at that stuff. Yeah, everybody dwells on it. Dude. Yeah, but with in this case, I like this product. You know, with with college, you have you know Alabama. All that you're missing is in a, this is, a number. is the number on the helmet. You know, same with Florida. You can. Was it Gator? Well, it's. Come on. You have the orange and blue. It's completely obvious. You know what team it is. So. What team is it? That is Clemson. Taj Boyd. I am that awesome. I know. That's I, a good. You're autograph. not retired. Yeah, that's my <laughs> fifth autograph. <laughs> like what I do for football these days, I literally pick up an autograph and a mem card of an Alabama guy if I can. <laughs> like right now, I don't even have any Lacey, but I do really? have Ingram. I do have Richardson. Okay. You know, so I I dabble, but I'm yeah. I'm not an active act wax ripper anymore yeah, because gotcha. it's just too expensive. I tend to dabble too much in other areas to to go too crazy here because honestly a lot of these players I don't know who they are. Yeah. So my uh, sixth autograph is a red ink autograph out of 199, Dry Archer. Dre, I don't Dre know, Archer. D-R-I, yeah. Kent Somewhere State running there. back. Not too shabby. Johnny Manziel, I probably have four Johnny Manziel base cards. Oh, and it's red ink as well, number 199. Yeah, I said that. But uh, the thing is, I, I think some of these players might have signed with the wrong color pen because normally a red ink's not out of 199, or it's a short print well, out of the total. Yeah, this one is red ink and it doesn't have. Correct. See, that could be rare. Gotcha. I mean, that, they've done that in the past. They used to have to send like breakdowns, like tables of what's okay, in what. Okay. Yep. Yeah. And I, I'm sure they'll do that again this year. Yeah. So um, sometimes there have been red inks with inscriptions mm -hmm. in the past where they're one of ones and you don't even know it. Yeah. So how that works this year? Don't ask me. Look for them. Ask them. But, uh, uh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Overall, though, I think the the number of uh, hits here is pretty impressive. There's not yeah. a lot of wax boxes out there that are going to give you six hits for probably a hundred dollars, around a hundred dollars. I don't know exactly what the price is because we're doing this very impromptu. But uh, it's not a high end brand, so it shouldn't be too you know crazy. I think that's the winning autograph of the bunch. Yeah, uh, check out that sig. It's pretty sweet. I mean, I think your uh, Taj Boyd one. Do I win? I think you win. Taj Boyd, one of the top. I was just going with the Alabama guy. Yeah. He's not USC. Oh, See, no, that's how yeah. much I'm out of touch. I am. <laughs> God, C it looked like it. Yeah, CJ Mosley, he's from Alabama. There you go. That's so. what I meant. Duh. That's the winner. He bailed me out. Yeah. So overall, I mean, it's 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 a, you know, I, I think I got four, four Johnny Manziels in a box, maybe more. Some in the short term, you can make some money back easily. You just get rid of those singles. Yeah. Um, if you get the right autograph, you're going to be winning anyway. Um, and of course, on card autographs, early early autographs before people start just signing with modified short signatures. There's a lot of things that can definitely be appealing in a product like this. Exactly. So, what do you think? I, I dig it. Should we, should we rip another? <laughs> another box? Sure. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay. Until next time, I'm Chris. This is Derek. We're going to rip one off camera. Sweet. <laughs>